Howdy folks, Jody's here, in person somewhat live. <clears throat> you know an interesting thing happened to me up on Faithin Street last Christmas Eve that I'd like to tell you a little bit about. It was the night before Christmas on Tatham Street. It had been foggy and snowy and windy all week. The youngins were nestled all snug in the bed and the hogs and the chickens had all been fed. Our socks were hung outside on the rail and hoped that the night air would get rid of the smell. It was cold in the house, so I put on my cap, lay down in the bed to take a little nap. From over in the kitchen, I heard this loud clatter, and I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave a light through the window to the floor down below. So away to the kitchen, I flew like a flash, and the floor was all covered with toys and glass. What to my wonder and I should appear but old Sandy and a bunch of reindeer. He lay sprawled across the table, a rather beat up old elf. I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. He was dressed all in red from his head down to his toe, with a black belt in the middle, black shoes down below. Curly white whiskers covered his face. His wrist and his ankles were all covered in lace. A fork from my table was stuck between his teeth. Around his neck hung my Christmas wreath. Reindeers were laying over there and over here, and the sink was filled with horns and hair. I thought to myself, is this really true? Or did I just drink too much of that old homebrew? Eggnog brew. Then he jumped off the table so loud and quick, and said, Ho, ho, I'm old St. Nick. To be continued next time, folks.